The Lord says, I am the King of Kings. I am the Alpha. I am the Omega. I am the beginning. I am the end. I am your strong tire. I am the rock of your foundation. The builders rejected me, but if you do not reject me, I will pour out every blessing upon your life past all imagination, past all that you can ask. I will bless you. All I ask is you surrender your heart to me. The Lord says, if you will surrender your heart to me, I will show you things that you never thought possible. I will mend your heart. I will mend your wounds. I will heal the things that are broken in your life. The things that are wrong, I will make them right. But you must yield your heart to me. You must let me work in you, says the Lord. He says the reason there's so much pressure right now, the reason there's so much pressure right now is because people must choose a side. People must choose a side. It would be very obvious what is evil and very obvious what is good. And if people do not choose, they will be on the fence and that is not where they can stay. They must choose a side. The reason why the things are happening the way they're happening right now as a world is because I'm exposing, I'm exposing Exposing all the corruptness and the wickedness in the world so that people can see, so that their eyes will be open, so they will be without excuse. Once people see, they must choose. They must choose me, they must choose life, they must choose my son or perish. So, my sons and my daughters, do not be fearful. Do not worry for the things that are coming to pass in this world, but be ready. Have your heart set upon me, your mind set upon me. Look like Jesus. Look, do not look like the worldly church. I want you to look like my son Jesus. For he is a shining example of my love, which I will reveal to you if you seek me with all your heart, all your mind, and all your soul. Father, we thank you, Lord, for this word you've spoken into this generation, Father. And we thank you that in every way, Father, every word you have spoken over us, over this church, over your people shall come to pass, Father. We give you all the glory, all the honor, Lord, and all the praise, Father, in Jesus' name, Lord. Amen, Father.